Do you remember the sensational skill of Peterborough's Stephen Smith, the table footballer? Well, he, the lad done well at Wembley. At last, English fans can celebrate victory over Argentina in a World Cup competition. The tactical awareness, speed and skill of Peterborough man Stephen Smith and his friend John Gillies gave England the upper hand in the Bar Football World Cup. The pair were victorious over Scotland in the group stage, trounced Turkey in the semis and then faced Argentina in the final. They saw hours of practice pay off as the ball blasted into the goal, a 2-0 victory. victory. So England won the cup and sweet revenge over Argentina. Well, more football tonight on Anglia. Kickoff starts at 11.40, so make sure that... Argentina, even if it was on a less than full-size pitch. Argentina put paid to England's hopes of World Cup glory when David Batty missed that vital penalty back in June. But out of the ashes of defeat, finally an English victory over Argentinian opponents in the world of table football. That's it! It's a fantastic victory! Five goals to two! It was the final sports fans could only have dreamed of. Well, we've got one over the Argentinians and we've put things uh, to right now. But fair play to them, they were an excellent team and superb people, really. Steve lifting the trophy at Wembley was the culmination of years of practice at his local in Peterborough. Now he's even got a table at home after winning one in the national finals. It was the most fantastic feeling, you know, after a whole day of uh, exhaustive uh, table football, very, very intense and very, very high quality. My friends and that have come around have been really good with the practice uh, matches and that. Uh, as, long as, I've got, as long as I've got plenty of beers in the fridge, uh, that's the deal. They take me on at table football. The first ever winners of the World Cup are now hoping they can retain the title. Deborah McGurran, Look East, Peterborough. Well done to them. Well, now back to Stuart and Amanda for the...